Hey there, everybody. Welcome back with the plat. Today, I'm going to show you how to synthesize Zoma is what I wanted to say. However, I decided to be real. Uh, I kind of started looking at the steps that you have to take to get there. I mean, I have Zoma um, and I'm like, there's just I don't have the skill or the I mean, I guess I have the time, but I don't have the talent to figure out how to easily make this digestible for you. This is a, I, so what I'm going to recommend is I'm just going to leave a link to this site down below and I'm not going to clickbait you guys with like, oh, the, the title should not be like how you can make Zoma. I'm going to find something that's a little more easy, but all right, let's just say here, here's how you make Zoma, right? King Hydra, Malroth, Bones of Bermos, Chalasmos, synthesize those. Oh, you need more? All right. Well, then, uh, in order to get those, you need Orochi, Tentaclar, True Dragonlord, Hargon, Baramos, Skeligon, Darkling, and Nagel. Oh, you still can't scout any of those? All right. Well, let's go 3D. Okay. So, actually, then, what you're going to need is which ones are, which ones can be scouted? So, this one could be scouted or found in an egg. So, War Toys, uh, Ursa Mega can be found in an egg, uh, One Man Army. Can that one be scouted? I don't think so. I thought he could be scouted, but I guess not. So out of all these, the only one that could be scouted apparently is War Turtle here. So then like, all right, well, you still can't scout any of that. So let's go four deep. All right. All right. Now here we are four deep. Finally, you can. Oh, wait, no. So you can't scout. You can you find out how to make this guy. So you don't need to scout him. But it's still like you still have to synthesize this guy. Oh, here we go. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Let's go to step four again. It was still clicked in there. Um, I mean, Phantom Swords, like, skeleton, you could you could scout maybe, like, half of these, right? Maybe. And so, if I want to do... Here, I mean, look at, look at, look at, here's Dragonlord. I made a long video on how to get Dragonlord. This is 1 16th or whatever, you know? Like, yeah, 4... Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is one sixteenth at this point. If I just did this level and how to do it, it's like, all right, get a dragon lord, get a king squid. How are you gonna get those? You figure that part out. It would just be like the the best I could do is maybe find out like what could be scouted, what couldn't be, and even then, it's just like if we go to level five, like look at now I have to look at this. It's it's like, oh yeah, what do you mean? You, in order to get, you need Scruffy to get a Darkling. In order to get Scruffy, you just need to get a Grandpa Slime. In order to get a Grandpa Slime, you just need an Emperor Slime and a Gem Slime. How do you get those? All right, well, you know, let's go. Uh, it looks like we might need to go down to like level uh, 10 in order to see how low we can go. All right, so let's take a look here. There we go. Now we're finally at a spot. 10 levels deep, right? Now you can get a Dragon Thorn. You need to get this. You need to get a Wordle. Uh, let's find Zoma here really quick, okay? Maybe a little faster. Maybe a little faster. There we go. All right. So there's the Zoma. That's the halfway point. We, in order to even use this page, we have to go that far. And these are all the, here's what, here's what you need. Okay. You know what? You're right. Let's start over here. Uh, how to fuse Zoma here. Let me help you out. Don't worry. I, I'll show you exactly what you need to fuse Zoma. You need this right here. Just slow down the video on 0.25. This is what you need. All right, you got it? You're about 10% through. Okay. We'll go a little faster. Uh, go, take it from 0.5 to point whatever, all right? All right, so you got to grab all these. You're about 25% of the way through now. And this is uh, not including these ones down here that I'm missing. Sorry. We'll have to go back through this a second time. All right. About halfway. And about 75. And there you go. All right. So now that you guys have your own Zoma, uh, I just wanted to let you know that... Uh, yeah, you know, you finally got that. You got the big boy himself. Let's click right back in the middle. He'll be here somewhere. Shoo! There you go. And that's all you need to get Zoma. Now you got him. 
And here's the thing. If you go on the site, it's really not that hard. If you just go on the site and kind of you do all the pieces first, you know, like you don't go for Zoma. Going for Zoma, I feel like is a madman's dream. But let's say we go over here. And if you realistically want my advice on how to do Zoma, go to four, you know, go to or like three deep, you know, and then decide first, how are you going to make the grandparents? All right. Focus on the grandparents. All right. How are you going to make Dragon Lord? How are you going to make this? So like start here, start with the Dragon Lord. Then after you get the Dragon Lord, start with Hargon and then start with Baramos. Knock these out in chunks, you know, make it so it's like um, something you could realistically do. You can even minimize these. So you're like, all right, first, I'm going to just start with not even uh, this. I'm not even going to start with Tentaclar. I'm just going to go with Orochi. All right. And then every time you get one of these done, you're, you know, an eighth of the way there. So start with that because it's just like Zoma wasn't hard for me to make, but that's because I didn't go for Zoma. I just kept fusing things that I didn't have, right? I had Bones of Baramos relatively early. And then, you know, I, I got to a point where it's like I had Razor Burn. Or sorry, sorry, sorry. I had, um yeah, I had Razor Burn. So I was like, well, let's just get Corvus. Then I had Corvus. I'm like, oh, I didn't know Razor Burn and Corvus. They make N Nagel. All right. And so uh, then I was like, oh, you know what? I have Scruffy. What is he fused with? Um, Oh, I can with Mortigon. Well, how do I get more Mortigon? I already have Jasper Unbound, so let's do Crystalinda. So it's like it wasn't that hard for me after I was finishing the Monster PD because I had everything. But if you're like on the lower echelon, don't do this. Do something like here's the thing: lower echelon, even True Dragon Lord, I think is reasonable in the lower echelon because all you need is the Dragon Lord, which is tough, but you could do it. And then you have to get a Dread Dragon, which is not the easiest thing. But, like, you could get to an S rank and stuff like that. That is, like, one, you know, again, it's, like, literally a 16th, you know, easier or whatever, you know, 15, 16 easier. Um, but, yeah, all for the video. I know it's not that helpful. This guide will be helpful, but you got to eat it in chunks. I was really excited to make a uh, How to Fuse Zoma, and then I started kind of writing down, and I'm like, I just can't. How, how do I do a lower echelon Zoma? I'm not willing to put in that work, and you shouldn't either. That's all I'm going to say. All right. Much love for platypuses, for platypus. I'll see you in the flip-flops. Bye.